the clock is counting down and it's time for Ukraine. It's going to be a really interesting year uh, for Ukraine and Eurovision. Not only because their song has been pimped within an inch of its life since being selected, but also because with the ongoing situation uh, in Crimea, there is a chance that the Ukraine entry could be festooned with sympathy votes uh, come the semi-final and then the final as I have no doubt it will get through to the final on May the 10th. Are we looking at a surprise winner even though Ukraine is so often sent contenders the year where they're not especially expected to win could they win for a different source of reason? until May the 10th. When the song was selected it was among one of the first to be picked, it was back in December. It was not an inspiring start uh, to the selection season. There was nothing uh, in TikTok uh, that really uh, got anybody's heart uh, ticking over time. It just seemed very bland, seemed very formulaic, there was nothing special about it. There was no element of it that jumped out uh, and made you think, ooh, now there's our winner. It's since had, in the three months since we first heard it, a really, really impressive revamp. It sounds more polished. It sounds more instant. It sounds more in your face. And in a year when there's not a lot of in-your-face stuff, that could really work in its favour. So you have to consider the potential sympathy votes uh, from uh, a public that is largely not impressed with what Russia's been up to at the moment, coupled with the, uh, well, near miracle that's been achieved with the, uh, with, the, with the thing that won the national final, then this could be uh, a certain top fiver on the Saturday night, and who knows, you need all sorts of factors to push you up to the winner's position. And could the uh, current situation be just that? It wouldn't be a complete disaster if this won. It's not the worst song there by a mile. Um, not necessarily the best song there either. But then when did the best song ever win, really? So I will say definite qualifier uh, from the uh, Tuesday night final. And from there, definitely top 10, probably top 5, maybe even top 2 uh, isn't beyond it. But we'll know more in May. I think I need to point in the direction of a Lego person. Good heavens, a 7.